first of all, I want to apologize because I don't know if you can hear it, but just in case you can't, my neighbor decided to mow their lawn at the right time of 8.22 in the morning. So excuse them and their suburban lifestyle. But anyways, hello my favorite people. Apparently last night Beyonce dropped that she's giving us, I don't even see, I didn't see. It's either a music video, it's either a movie, it's a documentary or something. All I know is that it's like they were producing something while the, air, the Renaissance tour was going on. And I'm gagged. As you guys know, we just went to the Renaissance World Tour concert last weekend. The vlog just dropped yesterday on this vlog channel and my main music reaction channel. And the experience, phenomenal. It's like, I would compare the Renaissance Tour to Taylor Swift's The Eras Tour for the set list, the production, she had freaking like, I don't even know. There was like a blue light bar that changed the white outfits. We were like doing tie dye with electronics. I have no idea how she did that. I know it's freaking expensive. Not to mention just the robotics, the lighting, the outfits. When she started performing America has a problem. It wasn't the margaritas only that were making me quent. Like I was gagged all night for hours. Not to mention also the throwbacks, Diva. Get me bodied, oh my God. She did so many different um, tributes to like uh, Michael Jackson. She did one to, I believe it was Aretha Franklin. Um, she just, it was such a glorious night and it was great to be in a room full of people who like, ha one, look like you, two, have a common interest as you. Like that is why I love going to concerts so much because there's, there's just nothing like, like the thing, the closest thing I feel like I can get to at, concert experiences is doing the reactions with you and coming on YouTube to talk and discuss and all this stuff because I know you watching also have the same interests as me. But to be in the same room and have the building vibrating and shaking from the energy, it's just insane. And I say all that to say now we're apparently like, I don't know if we're going into act two of Renaissance or what act two could mean. Is it a new album? Is it just a documentary about Renaissance? Is it a movie? Like music video? I don't know. I need a music video by the way. Why the heck is there no visuals? She said y'all got lemonade, that's enough. A visual album. No, it's not Beyonce. Get to a location and start recording, please. But anyways, guys, I don't wanna ramble on. Let's get right into <sighs> Renaissance something. I don't know. Subscribe for me here, by the way. This is my vlog channel, but I dibble and dabble into pop culture because that is my main interest. If you're from my main channel, then you know that. Uh, but yeah, subscribe here because you get a bunch of content and you'll get to know me better. Anyways, here we go. So it says Renaissance, a film by Beyonce. So it's like a concert documentary thing. It's not a music video. Mama, you look good. It's, uh. At first I was gonna say, is that Blue Ivy? Then it kind of looked like Dua Lipa. Then it kind of looked, yeah, no, no, no. It's not. Anyways, Beyonce look good. Ah! When I am performing, I am not. I'm sick. Oh my God. Blue. And look at her hair. I want to figure out how to get my little ends to start curling like that. And don't come for me, bitch. I'm about to get my hair redone literally after I finish filming this video. I'm getting the content out for you. Don't judge me. Anyways, Blue, she's that girl. When she comes out and starts doing her little dances. Oh, that was so great. Honestly, if you haven't seen the concert vlog, go watch it. It was so good. I am nothing free amen <laughs> parkwood entertainment parkwood entertainment she she does a lot rock nation ivy park they're uh, like um athletic athleisure brand parkwood entertainment no wonder they're freaking billionaires they're always working is it recording represent for us texas girlies i love it oh my god we get the we have beyonce we have megan the stallion we have matthew mcconaughey i guess we got dr pepper we got the longhorns we got the cowboy i don't know if the cowboys are something to be proud of about anyways texas where are those girls mm. the goal for this tour was to create a place where everyone is free Amen. No and she really did. You, you need me. 
and it ca it it, ca it was obvious. Oh my god, the diversity that was in that dang room. People in costumes, people literally, I didn't know there were so many, dang, I'll say it, LGBT in, in Texas, in Dallas, in uh, Houston. We're, relax. The community's everywhere, is my point. I was shocked, I was gagged. I was like, honestly, I was, I was, I was shocked. I was, ha it was like a happy shock, but I was like, wow. Cause when you're just walking the streets, it's very PWI, but then you get in this environment where the audience is, you, you get what I'm trying to say. I was just like, wow, maybe we will be a blue state eventually, but we can't reproduce. So never mind. Oh, you, I don't know their pronouns, but you are an icon. Did y'all see when he, uh, they were like running like like an animal on the stage and then into a death drop? Beyonce introduced me into ballroom and now I'm obsessed with it. I'm going to New York for my birthday next month. I will be vlogging the experience, don't worry. And I wanna get more into the ballroom scene, like the clubbing scene in New York because it's nothing like I've experienced in my 24 years as a Texas girly. Skin. Start over, start. That's an, I keep pausing I'm, I'm not gonna apologize, bitch, this is a reaction. That's also really why I love Renaissance and especially Beyonce. Like she continuously reminds you to love yourself and appreciate yourself for being different and having your own set of features. Cause like, I feel like we are taught and it's embedded into us to be like, why am I different? Why do I have these big lips? Why do I have this big nose? You know, why is my structure like this? And now people are trying to replicate it with the baby and lip injections but what's better than the authentic stuff you know you know start fresh create the new her voice Ooh. that's what the renaissance is about and you really did get the, i love all the the body positivity and different what was that girl talking about body 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 whenever they did the ballroom uh dance m number but anyways what was i trying Something about diversity, I don't even remember. Amen! Oh, the transformation, the, like the, the concept really did come through. I love the silver, like who, who chooses silver as a theme, but yet we still have, somehow made it work and then added like a cowboy, futuristic feel to it. It, it worked somehow. Everybody! Jack! I love the like vintage aspect too. Like the camera, the different camera work. It's uh, Beyonce! They look the fuck good. We dress a certain way. We walk a certain oh. way. We talk a certain way. That's your man, then why he over here? Mm. We paint a certain way. We, we make love a certain way. And any oh my god. Was her outfit changing or is that just the lighting? What the heck is this transition? Oh my god. That's different outfits. This is just the trailer. The production value is already immaculate. So imagine the actual freaking film. I'm gagged just sitting in my chair. Imagine at the theaters. When you got the surround system. No, I need the popcorn bowl to be a silver cowboy hat. I need apparently um, light wrist, light bands, whatever is a thing now everywhere. I need those at the theaters. I need this to be, you know, everything. I need, I need them to be like displaying a piece of one of her outfits in the theater, like that you can take a picture with. I need this to be a moment. That's crazy. At any point, the outfit. They could close their eyes and be right back there and take it with them. And I still, to this day, after going, oh, who are you looking to do, baby? Oh, is that where this came from? Because I was about to say, I still don't understand what this like silver cornucopia enclosure thing was for. Like, was it just to transition into a new outfit? But then I think it might be a reference to her daughter. Oh, 
That was the bear crawl. Oh, gagged. We added color at some point? When, Beyonce? Oh, wow. That's crazy. It's giving abstract art. Curvilicious abstract. I wish I had a waist that snatched. I need to get back in the gym. But no, it's giving for sure. Wow. What is Beyonce loves to be in the air. She loves to be suspended. She loves to be just, you know, she feels a breeze. She's always up in the air. She, but I hope she has good life and she probably does. Y'all hear that? My mom and her Nigerian friends. I gotta, hello mama. Hello uncle. I gotta go do my, if you know, you know. First gen problems. I have transitioned into a new animal. I have transitioned into, okay, Beyonce. And you still have that country accent. You can be a new animal, but she'll always remember where she's from. Animal. Renaissance. All of these things we do in a different, unique, specific way. It's so cool how they tie in the tech and the, you know, the thematics into like nature. I love that. Oh my God. It's, I, I've never seen honestly a concept like that, which is why I'm so gagged by it. A film by Beyonce. Like even the layout of the, this, like the spacing, the font style, like every little detail ties into the theme. And it's a theme I've never seen. And it just is a further testament, honestly, to why Beyonce is an icon. I was like, I was apprehensive to f the first time I listened to Renaissance, the album, because I was like, I know that this is gonna be something I've never heard from Beyonce. But instead of being scared of that, I realized now like I should have been appreciating that because it just, it shows all the assets and facets of freaking Beyonce. She can do so many different sounds. She can do so many different genres and she makes it sound good every freaking time. And now she's dabbling into cinematography and film. I will be sad. I will be in those theaters. Hopefully I can get the tickets because, you know, I didn't get tickets for the Eras tour for Taylor Swift, but I'm hoping that I'm able to get tickets for at least Beyonce's show. If not, bitch, I don't know. I'll, I'll pirate it or something. No, I won't for any judicial people watching. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching this video. This is my vlog channel. In case you are new here, I do content like this. I do content like vlogging. I do content like anything, ranking stuff. Just I do a lot of content over here. So if you're interested in that, subscribe and make sure you like this video so I know you want to do more content like this. But anyways, that's it for me. I will see you in the next one.